Hi, everybody, and happy Friday. Here is your announcement for next week. Next week in art class at Kings Road School, we're going to be continuing on with our Square One Art Projects. Day A, this is your time to start it. Day C and E, it will be your second day, so we are going to be wrapping those up. Remember, we have to finish those and send them out to a company. So if you have yet to bring in your class photo or your photo, please bring it in so we can adhere it to your project. At Tori Kindergarten, we're going to continue on with those baby chick projects. Okay, so we are learning how to draw baby chickens using some letters and numbers that we already know. And we're putting it in a farm setting. When we're done with that, we'll be tracing it with a magic marker and talking about our color wheel. We'll be going over our primary colors. We'll be coloring in each chick one of those primary colors. In second grade, first grade and second grade, we are working on our tiger portraits. Okay, we, last week we learned how to draw a tiger portrait using only letters and one heart. And now we'll be talking about our color wheel and we'll be influencing our colors of our color wheel onto our, onto our tiger. For first grade, you'll be learning about primary and secondary colors. And in second grade, you're going to be learning about the warm and cool colors. So we'll be dividing those six colors into warm and cool. In third grade, we'll be working on our name project. Most of our classes have begun our name project with just a practice day. So on day one, we uh, learned how to draw our, our name in different fonts. We talked about how we can pick and choose from different fonts that were available to us in our Google Classroom. Now we're going to be int introducing a element of art called value. Value is shading from dark to light or from light to dark. We're going to be using that knowledge to, add, to color in our picture. In addition, we're going to be using our color wheel and using that to color in the background. In fourth grade, we're going to be continuing on with our name project. Also, we uh, practiced using our different fonts and we started to brainstorm some of the things that made us us. And now we're going to be putting it together in our final, final project. And in fifth grade, we will be working on our Zentangle name project as well. We're going to be uh, practicing our patterns and our background using the elements of line and repetition to draw our patterns out. So there's your weekly preview. I hope you have a wonderful weekend and I will see you on Monday.